Hell, there's even shitty, like, standalone fan games that are done with that. I mean, just look at Sonic.exe. And on on reevaluation of me saying that, yeah, no, stay far away from Sonic.exe because that's fucking retarded. I don't know. Um, actually, I've got a ROM hack planned in the wings by, by my buddy KP9000. That's um Mario Three with a graphical facelift and like like aesthetic Mario World rules. Yes, I do have Steam. Who doesn't nowadays? <laughs> Well, like... Oh, shit. Haven't really been playing a whole lot of stuff in Steam lately, but... You know, I've got, like, Terraria and... A couple other stupid small things. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm... Neither a console peasant nor PC master race. I'm a hybrid of the two. Speaking of ROM hacks, Fi, how's that uh, Fire Red hack you're working on coming? If that's even still a thing. Because I I know I've got a Mario 3 ROM hack that I was working on back in 2009 that I changed a few things that I shouldn't have and fucked it up. So, yeah, I've lost all my work toward that. I don't even know if I should go after this one up. I don't think you should have too hard of a time with, like, getting the balance down. Because if you're just going to keep it with, uh, the basic setup of Kanto, you could just use the experience curves of the main game and, you know, just change things a little bit. What are direct messages you're talking about? Whoa. Ninjas! Honestly, I'm not even sure if I'm gonna finish this like I thought, because, uh, I'm already seeing shit that I'm not a fan of. Something like that I can get behind. I'm gonna go back to the save point because in case I die five times... Either that ghost house is a shortcut or a secret exit. used to that. Where I'm not sliding for a million miles. Know, let's try coming in here. There's a secret exit I doubt there is.
Jeopardy land will uh, actually be where I need to go. There we go. Uh, I have only played parts of Persona 1 uh, up to the seventh floor of Tartarus in Persona 3, but I played the ever-living shit out of uh, Persona 4. Oh. I missed one coin. I don't feel like fighting Larry. I mean, whatever. But I'm gonna try that one more time. Double grab with that fucking dry bones in my ass. Fuck! Bad idea, bad idea, bad idea, bad idea, bad idea. <laughs> Died anyway. Train Odyssey. Uh, there's uh, Etrian Odyssey 4, Etrian Odyssey Untold, and Mystery Dungeon. Uh, the, the only real difference between Untold and 4 is uh, Untold is just 4 with a uh, stronger story. And I believe I may have screwed myself here. Great! I'm gonna try this one more time. And then I'm actually gonna go back to progress. Good enough with the double grab. Okay, I'm not sure how that worked, but whatever, I'm not going to complain. Fucking Jeopardy theme all up in this shit. I don't understand why. Hey, but let's just play along. Fuck it. Alright. 
Press and select to mark spots. The clip will allow you to uncoil. Oh! Okay. That would have been something nice to know. Pressing select. Alright, Charlie, shut the fuck up! Distracting me. Fucking asshole. Pressing select. Yup. Fucking, I'm remapping my select button. Because I didn't realize it was going to be necessary. The actual fucking gameplay. Okay, I'm going to read that one more time. Press and select at a marked spot on the cliff will allow you to uncoil a rope to climb. However, without the rope, you cannot proceed. What is that supposed to mean? Do I need the actual power-up of the rope? Is that what that's telling me? Again, even though really low on lives, and this stage has proved to be a pain in my ass. Just like Morty and Summer to Rick. Because I've been watching that show a lot lately. I like the looks of this. Ooh, one up. That is tempting. Though I may just say nope. What? Oh, is there. F what? Oh, wonderful. Challenges. Great. F fantastic. No, I'm Pokemon out right now. Like, bad. Uh, tell him to refresh the page. Oh, shit. Can I go back up there? Yeah, I need a shell. Is there a shell that I can get to? Yeah, right there. <laughs> and that was an incredibly ballsy move. I'm surprised that panned out for me. I guess I'm getting way too used to the fucking ice physics. Because I'm able to abuse them. Alright. No! I should have spun jumped. Now, the sad thing is, I, uh, had actually just taken a break from Black to do Earthbound, and was already burned out on Pokemon again by the time I even finished the fucking run. It's just how tired of Pokemon I am right now. Shit. No mushroom for me. Never mind, no life for me either. God damn it. 
I'm just playing like a piece of shit right now. Okay, what's that actually saying? Do re mi Beethoven sees so la ti in a gentle breeze. No, <laughs> Mario has come to Mozart. Teach this scum. Yeah, this is a ROM hack. Fucking A! God! Ugh. Great! Sorry guys, but... This is a little obnoxious having to fucking... Walk that every freaking time. But yeah, yeah, because I didn't expect this to be an, ex an exercise in futility. I just figured it'd be a fun little romp because it wasn't finished, you know. 30 exits, what the hell? What could that hurt? Ha! 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 No. Oh, I need the mushroom here! Isn't that nice? The song you wrote made me write this note. The code, keep it hidden, otherwise you'll be better. What? Fuck! Okay. That note doesn't tell me anything. Damn it. I just can't seem to win, can I? Now I'm getting impatient. Probably getting impatient because I made the mistake of starting in the ice world. Fuck you two, game. You don't need a flash card. You've got a perfectly working computer. Get an emulator. SNES night, uh, ZSNES, I should say, is a pretty much perfect emulation. With, you know, the exception of being able to use filters, which, honestly, filters look like garbage. I was holding up on the fucking controller game! You know what? I don't even care. Why? You were never able to put the original Earth Bound in your pocket anyway. Yeah. Oh my god. You know what? No. I'm reloading my state for that because that... 
I. And if you've got, like, a smartphone, you know, either an Android or an iPhone, there's Super Nintendo emulators on Google Play and the App Store. So, you know, you should be able to, you know, get a Super Nintendo emulator. Okay, let's read this note again. The song you wrote made me write this note. The code, keep it hidden. Or... Okay. What code? Wow, that was a waste of my fucking mushroom. Is that gonna even do anything for me? Of course not. Okay, this, this room was pointless then. But I do want the mushroom. It's not as... Playing with a touchscreen is only bad if you're playing like an action game like Mega Man. I've been playing Final Fantasy 1 on my phone for a while now and it's perfectly fine for me. Now I'm just getting sloppy. One more try. What's the issue with the touchscreen controllers, then? Okay, there's obviously something in that. Just why this is here. Oh. You know, the sad thing is, is if you're coming out into this level on a replay, you don't need to do the, any of these freaking puzzles. You can just bring that blue shell from the beginning of the level. Kick it into that, and then, bam, you're good. Oh. Oh, boy. Tell me anything.
What? There's more power-ups. Cause this is a little shitty. Go back up there for that second mushroom. Or, you know, I could just die because I'm fucking slipping off with the ice physics. That's cool. Safe state abuse. Now I'm getting sloppy. Great. Oh, great. I'm back here. Just where I want to fucking be. Uh, I have actually been playing a whole lot of anything on my 3DS lately. Because, mainly because I'm still salty at the assholes that, you know, haven't sent me the item that I ordered from them months ago, and I've almost already paid it off with my credit. It's like, yeah, where's my fucking $600 3DS XL? With the capture bridge. Where in the fuck is it? I'm getting tired of waiting. Shouldn't be, uh, you know, unrealistic of me and, you know, unreasonable to expect to have the item that I ordered. 